So Steve, thanks, thanks again for taking the time today. So my, my name is Brent Watson, and I am the National Director of Career Services here at Wazoo. And so what our team does ultimately is we're responsible for getting our students ready for life after graduation. So it's anything from resume developing, preparing them for their interviewing strategies as they get out there, um, just giving them those tools for their toolbox so that when they get out there to uh, talk to those prospective hiring managers, they have a game plan. They know exactly what it is that they want to uh, try to get accomplished in terms of the interview. So uh, we have a wonderful team, and our team, uh, who is actually right here in front of us, these guys actually are in the trenches with these guys every day. The student groups that you had a chance to meet with today, uh, that's part of our umbrella in terms of getting them ready through their project phase and, and um, getting them out there in the field. So just wanted to share a couple of just real success stories with um, since um, Quaz has come on board and, and since the brand has uh, really changed our focus in the industry in terms of our relationships that we built. So, yeah, yeah, absolutely. So our um, one particular employer that, I, that comes to mind here locally is a, a Salesforce employer called Radio Spark. Uh, they are a phenomenal organization. They're actually a straight Salesforce organization. Uh, but they uh, came into the fold with us a few months back and were more interested not in a particular language or technology, but attitude. And, and that was really what was important to them. So we've had a couple of students, um, Bradley, um, Jeremy, and, uh, and Connor, uh, who have ended up on their team and are now thriving after just a short amount of time. And every time we go back to that organization and talk to them and get feedback in terms of um, what have we done right? What have we done wrong? Are there any uh, changes we can make? It's spot on for them. And for an organization that, that doesn't even service a climate that is really um, applicable to what our students are studying, speaks volumes to not only the curriculum, but to, um, you know, to the uh, level of support that you have provided and that our, you know, as our curriculum team builds those programs uh, for us. So, you know, I, I guess what I would ask you is, you know, is, you talk to these student groups today and had an opportunity to kind of see what they're capable of. What advice would you give them as they move out there into the workforce? It's, a, it's one of the scariest things in life. I've got some education. I've got some talents. I've got some skills. I know it inside, but the world doesn't see me. And that's something you go through, especially when you're young and new into something. And I've been there. And right. almost all of us have been there. And to have support, people that are sitting there helping you learn some of the simple procedures the first time through, you know, eventually you get to a point, oh, you've just kind of got it made, whatever happens, you can always, you know how to go out and get your career moving along and get new jobs and all that, but it's uh, so, so important the first time. That's just, that should be part of school. It's almost like, you know, because we're being trained in school and there may not be jobs there. It's like society doesn't say, oh, as soon as you get out of school, this is your job, this is your job. We don't work that way here. <laughs> right, absolutely, absolutely. So it's easy when there's success, but what, what about when there's challenges? You know, as they as they face these challenges, not only in their program, but but as uh, they get denied a position that they had an interest uh, an interest in, you know, what's what's a good way to overcome that? Challenges. It's not really my expertise. My expertise is making products and right. and doing engineering right. and uh, not so much in the social phase, but I care so much about people. You know, somebody who's having trouble, like finding a job, finding employment, um, any help at all, especially preparedness and giving them some ins to some companies that might want the skills they have. Um, it's one of the great things WASU does. Well, thank you. Thank you for the time. Really appreciate it. Yeah, thank you.